Hey guys, so this is a video of me uh, making some resin jewelry. So I'm just gonna um, basically give some commentary on it. Uh, right now I'm mixing resin with some dye and the green kept not being really the color I wanted it to be so um, I mixed in a darker green dye. Um, oh, my rings ripped the glove I was wearing because I'm wearing small like kid size gloves because that's all I had so. I'm just mixing the pink now. Um, so I decided that today I wanted to do some jewelry that was like um, in the spirit of like being true to myself and I really like pink and green. So I just did a whole bunch of jewelry that was like pink and green. And then the second part of the video um, I actually do some like real pretty blue and purple. I thought that was really cool looking too. So anyway, yeah, just, um, you know, if you wanted to like see how I created this stuff, you can just watch this video. So this is actually a little ring um, um, thingy that I got and I had never done a ring before. This is my first time so it was a little more difficult because it's really a skinny, a really skinny like area to try to put the resin into and um, it kept just like wanting to sit on top and I had to like push it in with the um, bamboo skewer that I'm using but hopefully it turns out really well. Now I'm just kind of like mixing them both at the same time because I thought that would look really cool and be something that like I would want to wear. That was kind of the goal today was just like what would I want to wear? So um, yeah just kind of like contrasting and glittery and mixing and different and also they the earrings that I made ended up being um, like opposites of each other like mismatch you know so I think that's gonna look super cool uh, when somebody actually wears them I was trying to decide which one I wanted to do and I totally didn't go with either of the ones I thought I was going to. I just changed my mind at the last second. That happens a lot. Now for some black glitter. I like black glitter because it matches my soul.
And then I was just trying to like make it kind of swooshy, kind of like um, swirly, not even. I didn't want it to be even, I wanted it to be like swirly and um, unique looking. And then I was like, um, I guess I could make some earrings that kind of look like watermelons. Like a watermelon slice or something. That would be fun. And then I ended up putting some black glitter in it to be like, you know, like little seeds or something. I thought that was pretty cute. And that was just like a random design I just thought of all of a sudden and as you can see um, I'm doing the opposite on the other one so like I did green and then I did a pink stripe and then on the other one I'm doing pink with a green stripe and there it's weird because like they turn out so different looking from each other And now I'm just adding some pink glitter and I couldn't decide if I wanted to do silver glitter or what kind of glitter I wanted to do to go with the pink glitter and I was like well I keep using silver all the time because I'm more of a silver girl so I ended up going with gold just to kind of like be different from what I normally do so pink and gold glitter is what we ended up doing. And this is the second part where I am going to do the um, purple and blue and they turned out really pretty especially that blue I think well thanks for watching my video guys um, I hope you enjoyed seeing like how I make this kind of stuff and Maybe I'll make another video sometime. Okay, bye!